Well, those campaign ads positions on political issues, many times they target the candidate themselves. And we are talking about the actual physical appearance of the candidates. Political reporter John Croman has more on the manipulation and some who contend is going too far in some cases. You do? Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah, I really appreciate it. It's a pleasure. I've if you've it. been awake the past six months, you probably heard that Ashwin Medea is running for Congress. I'm running for the third district. He literally runs through every scene of his strongest campaign ad. And it didn't take long to meet the real Ashwin Medea. Running for the National Republican Congressional Committee to use those same scenes against the Marine veteran in an ad called Running to Raise Taxes, something his camp calls a distortion. Ashwin Medea will make sure that no one who makes $250,000 or less a year will see any tax increase at all. But something else about that Republican ad caught the attention of local advertising experts. The shade of Medea's skin in the still photos is noticeably darker than reality. And I'm not saying that I know that the people who made the ads knew that this would happen, but I think they knew that darkening him uh, and making desaturating the color, making him look a lot less lively, uh, would have negative connotations. Yeah. Clay Steinman of McAllister yeah. College so teaches and writes about mass media messaging know, and consumer machine, responses. He compared the images in the ad the to the color source photos of Medea, who is the son of East economy, Indian immigrants. You know. Even if we think that we're not racist, people of all races, when confronted with images that are darker and different, um, have a kind of visceral negative response. The candidate himself would rather talk about the issues right now, but his campaign manager condemns the altered images. And I've seen negative campaigns, but nothing as deplorable or as disgusting as this advertisement and what the National Republicans have done. Now, one of the people who brought this issue to our attention was Dean Alger, a media consultant and political advertising expert, who wrote to us that distortions and exaggerations are part of the game. But in his words, the darkening of the Democrats' photos are beyond distortion and what he calls a subtle effort to convey the message that Ashwin Medea is different. In Washington today, Ken Spain of the National Republican Congressional Committee told us that uh, he uh, looked at the commercial on YouTube and in his words, we stand by the ad. Now, Spain works for the message side of the NRCC and cannot contact the independent expenditure side of the group, which is the part that actually produced the ad in question. Back to you. So to be clear, what you're saying is sometimes politics is dirty? Yes. <laughs> yeah, thought so. Exactly. Thank, thank you, John. Croman in St. Paul tonight.